So what happened to Andy Schleck? Why was he never the tour winner like we expected? Hopefully this documentary, Danish, will explain why. Check it out. I want to win the tour. The third week, of course, it's going to be decisive. Everybody know my weak point, it's time trial. And downhill in the rain. For the rest, what is my weak point? Some people laugh about it, uh, that the, we shave our legs, but a lot of people ask me, but why do you shave your legs? And in the beginning I had to think about it, but actually it's, we have everyday massage. And if you have like that long hair on your, on your legs, you don't do a good massage and it hurts like hell. And the second reason is we crash a lot and hairs get infections. And that's basically, and also it's more aerodynamic, <laughs> but that's a really small part I believe. And, I just believe it's more nice when you see bike riders with shaved, with shaved legs than imagine everybody in the peloton have like, uh, yeah, hair on their legs. So. Come on, Tana. Beautiful scenery. I hope I get the time to go and ski a little bit this afternoon, so. It looks like I have a meeting at 2 o'clock, but I'll be, I'll be quick so I can go out and play in the snow. That's a big part. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's only one hour. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you for coming. I've heard about this project for the past six months, and I've heard about all the good things and the new things and the new ideas and, and the new way that this project is going to bring into cycling. And I look forward very much in the coming years to seeing this project develop into reality to make this team different than every other team. I'm looking forward very much to, to seeing that. Because it is needed. Make no mistake about it. <laughs> you know, I can ride. <laughs> you know, English comes good. It's not too much. It's 6, it's 15, it's okay. It's a bit of a reflection. Yeah, well, that's good. Yeah. Uh, 7,5. Definitiv. Also, that's, just... that's okay. Yeah. I like to be like Bach or Beethoven. This is not my suitcase, how it looks in the tour. I was in a hurry yesterday, so I just packed all the stuff. I brought the running shoes, shoes to go out at night, the casual shoes, shoes for walking in the snow, shoes for skiing. So yesterday night we had a little meet and greet at the bar and uh, it was good, everybody was there. We got to know each other a little bit and um, the lot is built around me for the tour because I want to win this, this race and I'm going to win this race, so. 
I need a strong team around me. And I feel, you know, when I came yesterday, uh, I mean, we have uh, like 14, 15 riders who could make the, the tour selection. For me personally, and for Kim, this was something that I hadn't honestly ever imagined would happen to me in my life. <coughs> and the first three days here, we have a lot of meetings, but we also have a lot of really nice opportunities to be outside. I'm Christensen, mechanic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ricardo, technical manager. Anders Lund, and I'm right. Fabian, rider. <laughs> Jens, rider. Jay Eduardo, mechanic. And the rider. Robert Wagner, also rider. Jakob, I'm a rider. I think we, we have the possibility to maybe win the biggest races in the world. Maybe not the first year, but maybe the first year. I think if we all put everything in it that we have, I think we have a pretty good chance of staying number one team in the world in the sports ranking. But also being known as a humble team, but a team where there's no losers. Not winning is not the same as losing. Being a loser is someone who doesn't use all the opportunities we have, who doesn't make the best of all the things we have, and who don't make sure that we all believe in what we do. The end of the year was uh, not good for me. I was actually sick of the kind of mononucleos. I want to start earlier this year than the year before because I, I had last year a knee injury and I might come that I started too hard. If we can go train and look the stages in the tour, yeah. you can go in this period, we send somebody and you go look yeah. to all the other stages. Yeah, I mean the big goal is of course the classics in yeah. the beginning and then yeah. the big focus is, the, is in the end of the tour. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So we do it this year. We go for it. Yes. Des disques sorry. Oui, mais ça, ça marche pas avec moi. Non. C'est possible de le mettre euh, interne, capitaine. Interne. Ok. Mais pas dans le chaussure. Voilà, voilà, d'accord. En dessous, Ici, oui. De la chaussure, oui. mais au-dessus de la sole. D'accord. Uh, so, when? Ciao. 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 Andy and Good, ta, ta good to vise respect for his colleagues and omverden og på en god og behagelig måde. Uh, han er altid vældigt. Og så han, går han ind i folk med åben sind og, og bare glad. Han er jo en, man bare holder af, fordi han er, som han er. Jeg have to say, there are people I miss from saxophone. Uh, when I look around and I'm like, especially some riders, I'm like, they cannot be here with me. Um, some, a li sometimes a little sad, but then I see the new guys and I let to, I get to know the new guys. Uh, I have to say there are some guys I would love to see around me, but they can't, so. Ah, genial. Hey, a funny one, huh? Okay, it's a red one. Now we walk, tomorrow we ski. One is a rider, one does big results, the other is a mechanic, but we all work for the same goal, to win races. Whoa, 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 whoa. I like pressure, you know, in the races, I, I like that people tell me, uh, you know, my team boss or Bjarne, hey, today is your day, today you have to do this. And, you know, then I'm, I'm, this motivates me really. I know after this camp, I go home and uh, I got to be 100% for a long time. My back pain. <laughs> uh, in Mondorf, Leba. I grew up here, playing on the streets and uh, I have the terms here, um, gym, everything really nice and, and good for, for the winter and when I come back for recovering and for well, Luxembourg it's already, you know, not a small town anymore, but it's still quiet. This is uh, Frank's daughter. I'm the godfather of her. Frank and Martin, you want to go for dinner, I go down and take care of her. And I'm looking forward that she, she grows up because right now I got sometimes troubles, you know, too. She starts crying and I don't, they always tell me when she cries, you, you don't go there, you let her cry a little bit because uh, she starts now to get in character and uh, getting, you know, when she cries and you go there, she stops. You leave, she, she starts again and, uh... um, 
I got the right equipment, but I need to learn how to cook. But I like it actually. Uh, I see this is ice on the road. Yeah, yeah. Like that's what I mean. It's safer to stay home these yeah. days. <laughs> Do you want to go for a ride? Okay, perfect. You come to my parents' place. Yes. Okay, then we have also lunch there later. I don't know him that long. Oh yeah, since he's in, he came to, to Saxo Bank. I think the rest is done for me. I think Jakob is like a close friend, you know, of course I talk everything, everything with him. It's a really good team, good guys. You like the bike? Yeah. He did uh, actually ten, 10 tours. In the tour, he was always there to, to help the leaders. You see him here. That was actually the. What that situation? Pelfo or the big? Pelfo, yeah. With Ocania in the team. Uh, Luis Ocania, that was the first guy who actually came out and, and beat it. Uh, we did Max, so any Max versus Okanya, you you see that tour went into history, actually. I see that now. Wow, I even haven't seen this before. Jeg er glad dreng, når han kommer. Jeg glemmer aldrig det der, på en dag jeg kom ind på. Han boede sammen med Mati, som også var, var neo-pro. Jeg kom ind på deres værelse, ikke? jeg kunne knap nok åbne. Der spark døren ind ikke? For, for tøj og lort og skidt, der lå rundt omkring. Jeg kom ind, så kigger jeg, hvad er der sket her? Og de to gutter, de smiler bare ikke? Ja, hey, yeah. <laughs> ikke noget. <laughs> Den, det går sgu ikke, det der. Så hvis, hvis, I skal, hvis I skal nå noget, så skal I styr på jeres liv, og jeres liv, det starter lige i jeres kuffert. Talentet er åbenlyst, men det kører bare, som det nu kører, ikke? Og det skal nok gå alt sammen. Og det gør det jo også øh, til en vis grænse. Fra mine, mine venner og bekendte i Luxembourg, jamen, de sagde, ja, men Frank er stærk, men der kommer altså lige en til. 600. All the time. Yeah, I know all the time, but 560 and 600 is steep. You will. <laughs> Bjørn, he asked my brother, if, I, uh, if he had a brother. Og det er hans lillebror. Og han er endnu stærkere, siger de. Do you have a brother or cousin? Who rides a bike? Yeah, my little brother. He just ah, maybe he can be a stagiaire. Da jeg så de to brødre køre ned af en stigning, ned af en, en nedkørsel sammen, og deres teknik og, og så vil jeg sige, oh, det ser sgu godt ud, det der. Ja, ja. Jeg tænker, de to gutter, de kan supplere hinanden meget i mange løb. 
øh, i bjergene, men også på nedkørsel og på... Øh, der, der var... Der lå mange gode resultater forud, og potentialet var der i hvert fald til noget stort. I just want Frank, Andy and Fabian to come in as the last. For the questions for Frank and Andy, I know it's obviously more natural to ask them in Luxembourg, but there's, it's streamed live, so internationally everyone can see it. So A, we either do those questions in English, or B, you translate the answers. Because it's just, they're, they're part of the biggest, you know, names of the team. Uh, and if I make sure that I make it quick, the, the answer, and you make sure you translate. Thank you. Oh, uh, okay. yeah. But here we close. Yeah. Should I close it also? No, I don't think you should close it. Uh, 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 never the lowest part. Oh, if yeah. you close it, only the highest one. If you go with your brother and yeah. Cancellara and uh, Jakob to the stage. Yeah. <laughs> And here they are, Fabian Cancellara, Frank Schleck and Andy Schleck. In the long mountain hall, and felt it like let me also show you. Also in cycling, it's the same than uh, in uh, real life. You have to uh, start very small and then uh, you grow up to a real big start. Now all the riders are signed and everybody says, yeah, this is on the paper the best team. But now it goes to us, we have to show it also because it's not just, you know, team is how we ride on the road, not how it's standing on the paper. So that gives uh, pressure to us, yes. Because now we need to show also in the road that we, yeah, we are there and we win. Mabi, Mabi, Mallorca, Temo, Mexico, Atuiz, Bern, Degrees, Centigrade, Place, Mount, Tamar, Fortier, 21, Vienna. Same. Ah, vale. No coffee in the races. In training, you need coffee. In the race, rice. In training, I eat muesli and some bread and pancakes. <laughs> In East Germany, where Jens is from, you only had one car you could buy. It was a Trabant. Yep. And when the people ordered them, it took like 15 years to get them. Yeah, yeah 15 to 20 years, huh? Yeah. <laughs> That's how you grow the Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's a paper. Doesn't look like that good way out there. Can we do five hours? Fifteen minutes turning in three groups. Intervals in the clan. Hot day. I never feel good in the morning. The first day everybody was on time. You see the riders, they're coming later and later. They think that's gonna shorten their training. 
but it doesn't. We just say long hour day, so. 10 o'clock is 10 o'clock, but now we are 10 o'clock and there's still one, two, three, four, seven bikes standing there, so that means seven, seven riders missing. We get uh, in trouble later, you will hear it out there. Hop, 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 hop. I know you, you are tired, but let's, let's finish it in a good way. For the next work, when you have the 40 seconds and here's the 20, if the 20 is full recovery, yeah, you don't need to stay in a medium, it's a full recovery, but you should also not stop in a climb. Pedal. And then your heart rate should have always a wave that you go a little bit over and you recover. If you do, if you do it too hard, you don't recover, your heart rate will slide away. My heart rate goes down 15 beats. It's too much. You think so? Und Aber das ist doch aber der Zweck von der Übung. Du kannst dich nicht vergleichen mit anderen. Ja, mit Trinke ist auch. Ja. Guck mal, manche fahren den ganzen Tag hundertprozentiges Programm, um, um annähernd so, so gut zu sein wie ihr jetzt. Wir müssen drei Monate alles ja, ja. machen, um, um jetzt äh, ja, ja, ja. kompatibel zu sein mit euch. Ja, aber ich glaube, das ist das mein Vorteil. Auf dem Rennen ist er schnell rekuperiert. Ist ein Ausnahmeathlet. You know, with all the stops between and his breaks and filling up bottles, we were seven hours on the bike. Yeah. That's a quite long, a long day. And then it's good to do something else. And for sure tonight I will sleep good. No doubt about that. <laughs> Training done for today. In America, after we went the wind tunnel, I, I tried to bike there. Um, I did a lot of um, a lot of training in the gym. I have the power in the legs, but sometimes in the time trial, I don't get it on the on the pedals, and which means also a lot. We do a lot of uh, stretching right now, which I do always after massage with uh, with, with Joshua. Stretch. But the bike, he has a little bit short muscles here, in the back, uh, lower back too. Then we have to work a little bit for the, for the position in the time trial. And um, then maybe one day I can be a good time trialist. Well, we go on the time trial bike and oh. test test the position. If you wait till till June, July, it's too late. So I start earlier this year on the time trial bike. Schnell! Ja, ja, ja! Short turns! Shorter turns! Ja. 
Short turns, we get them. I feel pretty good on my time trap. Like, like, position is a lot different than last year, um, and I think it's good. Small details still to do, but that's why we we're working we're working on it and uh, start feeling like a bike rider again, not like a bike tourist. Il y a un du bureau, Ken Zawar, il va passer chez vous au bureau, il va prendre le papier et comme ça je vais lui voir cet après-midi et il va la rendre ce soir ou demain matin. I was okay second in the podium, but I was just happy to be second, and I could not have beat him that year. But last year it was so close uh, till even the final time trial, and yeah, the moment I went on on the podium, I, when he got the trophy, I realized that I I was not second, but that I lost the tour. The year before I was really tired physically. I barely couldn't get out of of the bed, and for a week I was just like uh, miserable. But this year I was. Physically still okay, but it was like, and every day I came like one hour or two hours later to the hotel and doing all the interviews in all different languages. I know that's part of the job, but after a while you get really like, you get really tired of that. And that was what marked me a lot uh, last year. I was, I was not physically so tired, but I was uh, more tired of the people around me. It's good when you are dynamic, but you still need your body to be sharp enough to push the the, the, the watts. So you need to find a little bit the middle way there. So the, you go around with the 45k an hour, and then they measure your watts. The goal is to get the watts down while you're going all the time the same speed. Um, so that you have the aerodynamic position, but also that you have the comfort on the bike, because in the wind tunnel you only have the aerodynamic. schnell wieder. Andy, du bist so schnell. Langsamer. Leistung 372 Watt. Bei 47 genau hat er gebraucht 372. Und das ist bei 45 okay. sind es 322. Ja, ist zu hoch. Ja, ja viel zu hoch. Ja. Da müssen mindestens 20 Watt runter. Ja. Sonst geht gar nicht. Ne? Du musst zwischen 300 und 400 Watt fahren. Um diese Geschwindigkeit, das sind etwa 45 km/h zu halten. Also das ist immer ein Optimum oder ein Kompromiss zwischen einer guten Form, wo die Physik, also die physische Kraft übertragen werden kann, zur Aerodynamik. Also immer ein bisschen Kompromiss. Man kann sogar, denke ich, erreichen bis zu 10 Prozent pro Session. Also ich denke mir jetzt hier, das liegt jetzt in Größenordnungen von 10, 15 Watt Bereich, wo wir hier Verbesserungen machen. Dann bringen wir nach 45. Weil normalerweise sollte ja der Rücken und der Kopf eine Höhe sein. Mhm. Du bist ja immer noch sehr hoch vorne. Ja, aber wenn ich. Äh, du kannst es ja mal probieren. Du wenn ich jetzt tiefer bin. Sonst kriege ich die. Die Beine meinst du schon? Die Kurve nicht am, am, am Rücken. Wenn ich jetzt ja, zu dir ja, vorne ja, bin. Ja, gut, dann, du kannst es mal probieren. 
10 Watt eingespart bringt auf einer Stunde eine Minute. Und das bringt dann auch einen Kilometer zwei Sekunden zum Beispiel. Zehn Watt schneller waren wir jetzt. Ja. ja. Das ist schon ein Stück. Ne? Ja. Er muss Watt. ja mehr Watt brauchen, ja. weil er es wäre. Ja, ja ich auch 79. Ja. ja, wenn er jetzt das Silber Watt fahren würde wie Frank, wenn wir da runterkamen, dann wäre er viel besser. Ja. Weil er hat vier Kilo mehr. Ja. Kein vier Kilo so. Speck, Kim. Nee, nee. Knochen. Ja, ja. ja, ja. <lacht> nee, nee. Nee, nee. Mal eine Witze. Ja, ja. Ich, weiß nicht, wo, ich weiß nicht, wo die vier Kilo. Ja. Hüfte vielleicht, hier bin ja. ich weiter. Ja. Because I remember last year, the last uh, time during the tour, which was the best time trial, I think, for me. I, I did so far. I had an average of 412. Average. So now I'm on 440 with a new position. And it's quite like astonishing what it. Uh, yeah, that, that can save you one and a half minute on a long time trial. And it's always a race of always. I get a little smack in the face. First day we lost the 16 seconds, Frank and me. Couldn't really go with the best. And tomorrow is important. I think the most important test of this season. Stage four. Well, I think we have Frank and Andy, who has to try to go today. Huh? Wait till the last climb. And then we go in here and turn left and we go up the climb. If you go with a smaller group, move a little bit back, be together, look, boom. I see a really, really, almost no chance for breakaway today. No. Because as far as you can tell, Radio Shack, they, they need to do it today, yeah? Because if it comes to the time trial, uh, Curtin wins, or Horner, they beat Sanchez. They need it today. So I think also. it's always going to tell they be... He, he won last when we did. He win two years yes. in a row already, I think. Yeah. If there is a possibility to go, go and try. Maybe we have the day. Okay? You ready? Boys, are we going for the last try that climb? Huh? Come on up, Ali. Frank, don't look. Don't look. Ali, Frankie. Go, 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 go. Ali. Very nice, Frankie. Come on, huh? very nice. Gordon cannot follow you, huh? Ali, keep going, huh? keep going, huh? come on. Ten seconds, ten seconds. Hey, good job, Andy, good job. Huh? Come on, Frank, you're close to the top now. Ali, go, 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 go. Ali, 18 seconds. Ali, go, 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 go. Ali, Ali go, 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 Andy, come on. Good ah, ah, here we go. Good job, boys, good job. I was playing coke, I was like, I have to try. It's only like two k's, between two and one k. Then the corner I went, but... Attackiert er in der Abfahrt oder über den Berg? Abfahrt, ja. Ja, Abfahrt. Suicide Mission. Krankenhaus oder Podium, ne? Aber warum do you always have to put this fucking finish in it down here? You can also make it on the top, how, how, what a nice finish is it? It's a long suicide dream. I keep my head straight to the two. And today I could see I'm really up there with the, with the best and uh, the feelings I had, the sensation I had in, in my body, in my legs in the end was actually really good for my confidence and I knew that I, my chances were pretty small to win there. 
because it was going like downhill. I sweet. Oh, sweet. Two or four must be twelve, seven, but per kilo. Yeah, six point four, you said. Yeah. Aber es ist schon interessant zu sehen, wie du dich entwickelst von äh, Januar bis jetzt. Zwei Kilo weniger, dann. Äh, <lacht> ist noch besser. Ja. Zwei Kilo weniger, zehn Watt mehr. Ui, ui. Ja, dann hast du weniger Watt auch. Ja. Aber das hier ist doch mal. Äh, als Ein Beweis. Ja. Beweis, dass es äh, halt auf dem richtigen Weg ist. I hope to do a, a good time trial. It's a test for me, myself. Then it goes all the way downhill to the finish. Nah, but it's not flat. It's paper. I go on the bike and try to hold, the, keep in, stay in the position and push my watts. I uh, have the SRM on. I'm gonna try to don't start too hard, but then go pro progressive harder uh, to the end. I mean, that's how the good time trialists, they do it. That means I have an average of uh, 420 in the end, and then I know I did a good time trial. It's a test to push your body to that point, which is really, really painful. As it's for the last day in the Tour de France, and I have yellow on my shoulders, and I got defense 30 seconds. Come on, see if you can gain a little bit. It's very, very, very good. Now it's hurt everybody. Come on, hey. Be a little bit careful. A little bit careful down here. Ah, yeah, then we attack again. Huh? Come on. Ali. Did a very good climb. Huh? Now we have to go to the finish line. Ali, come on. Ah, it, was a, it was a hard time trial. Uh, I lost uh, time the last section. On the top of the climb, I had the same time as this video cover off, which is uh, pretty good for me. Keep going, it's very good. Huh? Just have to be very fast at the end. It's very, very, very good. Huh? Be a little bit careful up in the next All right. left turn. Huh? Be a little bit careful. Uh, I lost the last part in the downhills. Um, yeah, also, I didn't like to risk uh, too much uh, in the corner, so... That's good. Now we go to the finish line. Ali, Ali, Ali! Ali, come on, go, 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 go! I'm happy with the new position and... Yeah, in the end, I mean, I think I finish uh, 11 overall, so not a bad, uh, not a bad papers. It shows that I improved the time trial, and uh, after this, I mean, I'm going to work more in that uh, before the tour, and then hopefully I won't uh, lose anything to him anymore. Andreas Kloden, Chris Corner, retard Robert Gessi. Ja, hier sitzt er im Rim. Zwischen den Rennen. Jetzt haben die Blumen. Und uh, Andy kommt ja hin und dann nach dem Training und dann legt er sich auf. <lacht> ist er ganz ruhig. Like uh, this fishing place uh, where I bought it uh, 2009 after I won Liège. I choose that because that's like really, for me, it's uh, life quality. Dann grillen wir hier und dann sind wir hier, die sind viel mehr alleine, ruhig mit der Familie und so. Und Freunde. Ich habe schon oft gesagt, so in Côte d'Azur war, 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 es, war es kaufen oder was mieten, aber die wollen nicht, die wollen immer hierhin zurück. Und hier ihr Training machen mit den Hügeln und äh, kleinen Bergen und schön an der Mose, an der River entlang. Und die sind hier glücklich. I'm in charge of the wake up. I just missed my wake up, I don't know. What did I do? Didn't ring. The 
want actually to wake up at seven to get used to the race time on Sunday, but it didn't work. So now I got like four, four and a half minutes to get dressed and get to the bus. We do the last uh, 110 kilometers of uh, Liège, Baston, Liège. It's a kind of training, but you see everybody's nervous and cheat up because I feel like in a race already because all the teams are passing us. Come on, we gotta catch these guys. Bye bye. Allez! Contador has dropped! When he won, was two years ago. We eh? attack here. When I won, I was alone here. I had one and a half minutes, so just enjoy the crowd. <laughs> So we're going to start with the Q&A. Yeah. I'm going to ask them to ask as much questions there. What is Q&A? Question, and, Question answer. and answer. So okay. they have a microphone in the... In the in yeah, the, but uh, let me make some fire there because I don't want to sit for one hour after that. Uh, no, no, the Q&A the... is 20 minutes. One trick for you guys, just give shorter answers than usually. Then it's finished. If they say two questions but you give long answers like Cancellara, you're there for 10 minutes, you know? Mm -hmm. But don't say yes and no. But short answers. Mm -hmm. So how's the race going to be? Uh-uh. Mm -mm. of my fans, yes. Uh, come on, let, let now us... Now you come us. out, and Andy asks, where, where, where does yeah, the next... No, can you get Andy out? <laughs> come on, yet. Get out of my way. I need Andy. That's a good one. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, How you carry this on? Yes. It doesn't fit in your suitcase, huh? No, no, it's OK. <laughs> and tomorrow is, should be the highlight. Now, then, we just have to find out how we do a race. For me, in my head, it's important that I'm for sure in the fucking downhill of, uh, of uh, from the Eddie Max sign of Stockholm, I want to be second or third. Yeah, I have to say it. Also, in the, in, in the final, when you want something, you really have to say it. Mm -hmm. If we try to bring you in front and you're not there, then, then yeah. tell it. say that's, something. That's, because that's, that's, yeah. it's also stupid. One guy is sitting four kilometers in the wind for you. And then you look back and then you're sitting 20 places behind. And when we come to the top of Cotabana, that's the point where we have to go. Yes, I think that you, Jens, when we come to Cotabana, then you go fucking hard, but you don't drop them. It have, you have to go almost to the limit. Eh? I, I, I know. Guys. I, Jens, you know what but we mean. You guys are so much better than us. So we have to be close to 100%, then you guys still at 
75 probably. It's also the point that we come to uh, Cotevane and we are all still fresh and good. And Today we put name on the job. Maybe we should choose now one who looks after Frank and one who looks after me. What do you think? Yeah. Who want to be like my soulmate tomorrow? Anas. Yeah. Anas, okay you, take, uh, you take there. We go out and we take a fight tomorrow. We are dead when we are in the bus. So Ryan knows him, he kind of fall off. He must be getting nervous. Voilà les deux frères qui se félicitent. Andy qui dit chapeau à Philippe Gilbert. Quelle finale de liège bassonien Je que ce fut dur. Que votre promotion soit exceptionnelle. Ich habe heute einen Zanik und habe probiert. Ja. ja, das habe ich gesehen. Aber dann hat er auch einen. Ja, ja, ja ein Konto gehabt. Aber ich habe da auch nicht panikiert. Alles gut. Nächstes Jahr habe ich zwei Chains für one or two. Yes. <lacht> I, I believe today the strongest way in front. And uh, it gives me, of course, good confidence. I mean, I peak now my condition and uh, now I'm going to take it easy a little bit and then prepare for the tour and I think that's the best, uh, the, the best, the best I can be now. And this is uh, one of the big young talents, Wouter Weiland. I'm a Fle Flemish rider and there are lots of beautiful classics over there, so... I start to race for that. situation like that before. My mom called me. I'm like, why is my mom calling me? And she knows I'm in the plane. There must be something. 
I called her and she was crying on the phone. I said, Mom, what's happening? She said, yeah. She told me what happened and then I was just standing there waiting for my luggage and I couldn't, I couldn't believe it. We were always friends because we were kind of the same age. In the winter when I went to the track to Ghent, we trained there together, we met in the evenings and went for dinner together, so... It was always like kind of, we well, were joking, ah, maybe one day we ride in the same team and this year was the case. After something like that happened, you just start doubting everything. It takes a lot that I start doubting my, my sport. But I believe this was something really hard for me, for the team, not imagine his family. Now we wait during the tour. Keep him in mind with me. I am more worried about the others because it's like I have Frank in the race. And when there's a crash, I'm always looking if he's in that that that's more what, what bothers me than about me. I don't mode signs mode might sound stupid, but I don't care so much about myself because I feel safe. If it's important guys, I have to follow them. Huh? I just try to concentrate more on the road and on, on the corners and... Uh... It's really important these days now. My preparation, like uh, the downhills. Salavi. <laughs> Das ist vielleicht wichtig zu sehen, ne? ja. auch wie die Abfahrt da ist. Ja. Und so. Das ist sau gefährlich auf dem Fiede. Das ist ein harter Etappe. Plateau de Bay, ja. ja. Ich glaube, das wird mit der Entscheidung. Ja. Zwei Tage da und dann drei oder vier Tage in der Alpen. Schön hier. Ja. Okay, Handschuhe. Boah, gut, dass du das weggemacht hast. Die Olle war ja hässlich wie die Nacht. Wie lange ist dieser Berg? This is no, this is the road. Ja, wie lange ist der? Ja, ein Kilometer von da unten bis hier. I don't want to have anyone next to me in the downhills, because I really try to to recognize the corners. I really concentrate when I do them here. I don't go fast, but I just 
No, okay. There's a corner as a turn who closes in the end. Sometimes definitely you have like chicanes, you don't know, or a tunnel who comes up. And if you know it before, then you can be in a good position and come, come through it safe. And especially don't be stressed before the downhill. If you think about, oh, what is if we crash here? That also, you lose a lot of energy with that. Like when we had uh, last year the stage to uh, Tourmalet. And I said, listen, I prefer that we lose like a few meters in the downhills or maybe 10 seconds. That day I saved a lot of energy and I luckily had the support of the team that he stayed with me and they respected that I didn't want to take any risk before the final climb. In the end, uh, I mean, I won the stage, so it was good. Worked out the tactic. The goal is still the same. <laughs> I want to win the tour. The goal is coming closer, it's coming really close. Yeah, I am where I want to be now. I feel, I feel good, I know I need to lose uh, one, or, one and a half or two kilos. Han er en eminent uh, uh, bjergrytter. Uden jeg vil egentlig sige, at han er den typisk bjergrytter, men uh, når han er nede væk, så, så gør han det så stærkt over. Jeg tror stadigvæk, der er, der er forbedringer at hente. Men øh, nu kører han ikke på mit hold, så jeg vil ikke give ham de fif. Vi har taget det på vejen.